Welcome to Everyday Review's first Toyota-thon. That's right, we have Toyota and Lexus products all around us. We're here at the North American headquarters for Toyota for what they call HQ Confidential. So during this video, you're gonna see a lot of new products, some special edition ones, uh, new models we're going to ride, we're gonna drive, and we're gonna see some amazing reveals. So lots of news from Plano, Texas this week. On the Lexus side, the small luxury utility UX is now exclusively a hybrid in the United States with new S-Sport trims. The UX has been only hybrid in Canada for a while. We also had a chance to see the new RZ or RZ in the US all-electric SUV for the very first time. This futuristic EV will feature drive-by-wire and a direct four all-wheel drive system. Is it cool? Oh yeah. The big reveal from Lexus was their bestseller, the RX. The 2023 model is new from the ground up. It's built off of the new GAK platform. The RX offers more passenger and cargo room while remaining the same size. You get better handling, new bold styling, check out that new grille, and an all new interior with the latest Lexus interface with available 14 inch display. And for the performance enthusiasts, a new RX 500H. This sports model will feature a high-powered hybrid system, all-wheel drive with some other performance upgrades. I sure can't wait to get behind the wheel of these. Make sure to check out our RX review after this. Once again, look for this new RX in your dealer before the end of this year. Switching over to Toyota, man, there was almost too much to keep up with. What's coming in the near future? How about a couple of anniversary editions? Mainly cosmetic, but first is the 40th anniversary 4Runner with a unique graphic and wheel package. I'm kind of digging the retro look. And the Sienna is 25 years old, so it'll also get a special edition as well. Well, they didn't forget about you performance enthusiasts. Toyota introduced three new models of their GR vehicles. First off is this Solar Shift orange gr86 special edition there are only 860 of these made along with the now more powerful 2.4 liter 228 horsepower boxer engine the special edition gr86 comes with a cat back exhaust 18 inch forged matte wheels and a duck bill spoiler What do you think? I think I love it, especially in this color. This is the GR Supra, and what better way to harness the 382 horsepower from that twin scroll turbo engine than a six-speed manual transmission. This is the GR Corolla. We did a video on this earlier on, but guess what? They introduced something a little bit different for a GR Corolla. Check this out. This is the GR Corolla Marizo Edition. Marizo is Accio Toyota's racing name and it's the highest version of this race-ready streetcar. The Marizo has a stiffened chassis, more weld points, increased torque, shorter gear ratios, monotube shocks, and it's been lightened even further. The Marizo Edition only comes as a two-seater and is limited to only 200 units worldwide. So you'll have to put your name down now if you want a chance to have one of these hot hatches in your garage. Sticking with the Corolla theme, although not quite as exciting as that limited edition GR Corolla, this is the Corolla Cross, but not any Corolla Cross. This one is now the Corolla Cross Hybrid. Yeah, so they've taken that super thrifty, subcompact, popular SUV and they've put the Toyota hybrid system in it. So it's even more thrifty, but you get more power, 194 horsepower out of that two liter engine and that hybrid system underneath that hood here. You get a different front end on the hybrid as well as a different back end. You'll see, I like the smoked emblem here. You get the LED headlamps, up to 18 inch wheels on here and inside, 
all Corolla Crosses now benefit from Toyota's new multimedia system. So that comes standard with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And overall, you just get all the goodness of the Corolla Cross, but now more power, better efficiency, and all-wheel drive. You put it all together, this is a lot of features for a small package. One thing Toyota is really good at doing is providing buyers options. So maybe you don't need the 300 plus uh, horsepower from that hand-built GR Corolla engine, but you want something sporty, you want something fuel efficient. Well, the Corolla sedan and the hatch have new trim levels now. And before you had the hybrid where the Corolla Cross didn't, but now you get the all wheel drive system in the Corolla sedan as an option. And this one is the hybrid. So you have an e-hybrid system similar to what you'd find in the Prius e all wheel drive. This is the SE. It looks pretty good in this red. You get 19 inch wheels, you get LED headlamps, LED tail lamps. You have a very sporty rear valence. What's nice is if you live up north like we do, we don't get this amazing sunshine all the time in Texas in the warm weather. We get harsh winters. That all wheel drive system is gonna be a huge plus for Canadian buyers. Toyota also showed some of their new technology, including their cabin awareness concept. This system can detect any living being through the entire cabin through a single radar sensor. Even a baby's heartbeat will alert the system and can alert many others through your smart home, your phone, and can alert multiple contacts on your list. Attention, Toyota Connected Intelligence has detected the presence of a lone occupant in your green Toyota Sienna. Please check the vehicle. Although this is just a concept at this time, I'm sure we'll be seeing this feature on future Toyotas. If you wanna find out more, there will be a full separate video of this new feature. That's just a little tease of what's to come from Toyota and Lexus for 2023. There's so much more. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you do because it doesn't just help the channel grow, but you'll also know when we get to hop in and drive these vehicles, which could be really soon. Thanks for watching and goodbye from Texas.